Finally tonight, with the border between the U.S. and Canada still closed to all but essential vehicles, you would think that Border Patrol agents in northern Maine would have less to do than usual. But agents are actually at a more heightened alert for people who are trying to cross illegally. Plus, many of them have taken on an additional duty. Here's New Center Maine's Hanny Ashivi. A long line of cars slowly but surely makes its way to the front of the Prescott Forum where volunteers are busy. It has to be truck to trunk uh, because it's fresh product. And so what it would mean was going to parking lots, setting up a trailer truck, having people drive through, low touch, no touch. The COVID pandemic touch, trailers with 1,030 pound boxes of food, courtesy of the USDA program to help families in need. No age limits, no income guidelines, and an unusual team of volunteers. Here we have all these Border Patrol agents in the area. They're all young and capable and able-bodied. So they've been helping us. Under the direction of Chief Jason Schneider. Giving back to our community, I, I think that's equally important of, of, you know, the mission of the U.S. Border Patrol, protecting the citizens of this country. Protection in the form of lending a helping hand. If you need help, you get it. A fast-paced effort happening in several strategic locations in Arista County. And then when you see those long lines in every single town you go to, that tells you that tremendous need. Let's just say that I skipped the gym that day because uh, you're lift, lifting thousands of boxes. And uh, but again, it's for a great cause. Honor to be a part of it. Um, and, and just to see the smiles on the on the recipient's face. Faces that may turn out to be familiar. You know, we're we're your neighbor. Neighbors helping neighbors, even if they wear a uniform. Hannah Shivi, New Center, Maine. According to the Good Shepherd Food Bank, Arista County normally has around 11,000 people who are food insecure, but because of the pandemic, that number has ballooned to 15,000.